Hi, greetings and welcome back to Glassy's Kingdom. It's another reaction video and we're happy to see you again. It's the new year, 2023, and we're glad that you've made it over. It's a blessing. Thanks for joining us again. Today we're looking at the latest upload from Ali Bata. And of course, he's the greatest uh, fingerstyle guitar player I know from Indonesia. I call him Master of Strings, God of Harmonics. This new one is called um, Riorian. It seemed like an original. Um, he's using an electric guitar. Now, this is going to be crazy. I remember requesting last year or suggesting that he do an upload with an electric guitar and request granted whether he did it because i requested or he did it just because he wanted to do it he did and he did absolutely great and tonight or today we're looking at another electric guitar upload now this is going to be quite fascinating and i can't wait to see what it's going to be so let's go right in This is crazy. The first thing that I want to start with, it seems like there's an overdub. So it seems like he played a first track. He recorded a track first um, with very little guitar, like just uh, um, some chords. And then that is the base of the song. And then he's playing what he's about to play or what he's already playing over the top of that. Now, what is crazy and what I already love is how smooth he's going with this incredible technique of tapping and he's playing some arpeggios. Um, he's running across the guitar neck like the back of his yard. Like he knows this thing, this instrument, he knows it so well. He's just what the a uh, you know what let's get into some more music let's get into it really but this is a really good start it's really impressive that he started off all this banging so early he could at least give me a chance to get ready and to prepare for what is to come but right at the get-go he starts with his craziness already um let's get into more of it Let's just start from the top and go right through, shall we? Um, I really wanted to play the song all the way out and then do my commentary at the end, but I couldn't help but saying something right here, you know, less than halfway through the song. Um, uh, are you listening to the drum pattern? 
this seems like um, it's very little, like it's just a Hyatt that is keeping the time, the pulse. That is all that is going. He might have a second beat somewhere there, but that is all. It seemed like he probably did this. Like it's not a very fussy drumming or anything like that. It seemed like he just went on um, his computer and just uh, recorded just a simple thing to keep the timing, even though he doesn't need it, but he does it anyway. And normally he doesn't really need a lot of accompaniment, you know, you know, like other instruments because he plays so much on one instrument that he doesn't need anything else. Um, the other thing that I notice, and, um, it actually suggests that this person that is playing the guitar knows it very well. It also suggests lots of practice. Now, I don't know where Alec Butter gets the time to practice, but I know by looking at a musician's left hand, it can tell how well they practice and how well they know their guitar fretboard. His dexterity is so fine. You know, when somebody's playing and they're not lifting their fingers too much or making, like, you don't see the effort that he's making to go across the face of the guitar or the fretboard of the guitar, he gently glides over it. And he does everything in, the, in, a, in a very tiny space. He's just, like, right here doing a lot of stuff. That is mastery. So what he's doing, this is no ordinary level. Wow, this is impressive. This is absolutely beautiful. And it's great to see now, see now that he can do all this on an electric guitar. No, that's it. He's the best. It doesn't get better than this. I've always wanted to see how he would handle an electric guitar. Now that I've seen it, he, the guy is a beast. Alip is a beast. He's nothing normal. No normal person. Wow, it's incredible. Absolutely incredible. That's a signature slide. Run. That was immaculate. That was absolutely fantastic. And you know what? I literally, believe it or not, I respected him so much this whole time as a master of strings. But trust me, my the level of my respect for him has gone up a lot with how he, with how he handled this electric guitar. 
so smooth, so effortless, so easy. Running across the fretboard, doing all these arpeggios, arpeggios, doing all these tapping and plucking, um, the slides, um, some of his signature styles was in there. Um, the bending of the notes, they were so smooth. Now, I liked how he he didn't use a full distortion guitar. It wasn't fully distorted, so it was like halfway between clean, or should I say he added a little bit of distortion to it. So it was halfway between clean and distorted. And it provides a very good tone. So tonality was on par. His, um, I should not even be critiquing his playing. This guy is just, this master is just a master. And I am not even qualified to critique his playing. But it is so beautiful that I I basically should just react to it. I really should only react to it and not say anything because this is just incredible. Um, his level of musicianship, it's far above anybody that I actually know personally. I can't wait for the day when I get to meet Alec Bata personally, whether he comes to the United States or um, I have to go to indonesia to meet him however it happened it just has to happen because this is just remarkable thanks guys for requesting these amazing videos i could not get to react to it earlier than today because i was away from home for the weekend um i went to see my family for the for the end of year and i am just back um at home so thank you for requesting and thanks for joining in and for joining to watch with me and Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. Peace.